Well, I'm breaking out the Dash Mini Pie Makers again, and this morning I want to make some raisin, date, and walnut, and oatmeal muffins. I'm using one of those little packets that you can get, the little instant packets. And so you put one packet in a bowl, and this is so easy to make, and then one half cup of self-rising flour. Now make sure it's self-rising. One half cup of self-rising flour. And then we want to put some butter in, and we're going to grate in about, oh, half a tablespoon, I suppose. Just go by uh, how it looks, so I don't really measure it about that much. Okay? Let me scrape off some of this. We don't want to waste that good butter. Such good flavor. All right. And next, we want to put some milk. And this is whole milk, and I'm using that same measuring cup. So, one half cup of milk. All right, now all we need to do is stir it together and just take your time. There's no need to, to rush at all. We're waiting for the Dash Mini Pie Makers to warm up. And by the way, they would make an excellent Christmas gift if you know any singles uh, because they're just so easy to use. I've got a bunch of different recipes for these pie makers. And the, of course, the Dash companies make it all kinds of different kinds of of a little mini cookers like this, waffle makers, and I don't know, a bunch of different kinds. I just have this one. I have, well, I have a couple of them, as you can see, that was uh, given to me by my granddaughters for Christmas presents. And so I've really enjoyed using them. So simple. Waiting for the lights to go off. You see how quick this is to bring together. All right, as soon as they get up to temperature, the light's off on this one. And now all you do is pour equal amounts of this uh, batter in each of the little pie makers. Doesn't get much easier than this. You don't heat up your kitchen. You don't use all that electricity or gas that you would use in your big oven. But uh, this just works so well and it's so simple. And you close that one and we'll do the same thing in the other one. I hope you're doing well. I hope where you live everything is going all right. I know the price of food is going up. That inflation is really hitting us tough. We get all of that in and then close this one off and we want to cook them for about 10 minutes, 10 or 11 minutes. And look, can you tell that the tops have been pushed up? The muffins are pushing up and lifting the lids and that's all right. Now if you don't have self-rising flour, you want to add about three quarters of a teaspoon of baking powder to the flour and you can use regular all-purpose flour. All right, time is up. Let's take a look. Very good. There we have them. Nice and done. Simple raisin date and walnut oatmeal muffins in the Dash Mini Pie Maker. Look at that. Beautiful, huh? Nice and hot. Something a little different for breakfast. Let me open one up, let you take a look. Beautiful. Very, very good. It's hot. <laughs> All right. Well, that's how you make them. Let me get, get a taste of this one. Mmm. So good. Anyway, thanks for watching. Take care. We'll see you next time. Bye now.